how are you guys feeling heading into the meet? Um, I know we came off a great meet at regionals and a great two days in a row, so we are, we're prepared for this, we're ready, and I think this team is super excited and super confident, and I think having all these people here, we brought a few extra people, we'll have a lot of fans, I think we're ready to go. Yeah, you guys had a great performance at regionals. So what has it been like the past couple weeks um, preparing for here? Um, we did have a great performance at regionals, but we've just been hitting the details. I think that's super important. Landings, pointed toes, the smile, the presentation. So that's really what we've been working on. We had a great send off on Tuesday, so we're excited. Um, and how did practice go today? Feeling out the equipment, everything goes smoothly? Um, it went smoothly. We had to feel out the equipment a little bit. It's a little bit bouncier on podium. So we adjusted pretty well and we're, um, Excited for tomorrow. Yeah, and tell me more about you. Like, you've been having a, a great season as well. Um, what's it been like for you performing this year? Um, I think this year, last year we really worked on confidence, but this year we've really been working on consistency, and I think um, we're peaking at the right time. We know exactly what we need to do. We need to come in tomorrow with our heads held high and know we can hit these routines, and I think everyone on the team is ready to go. And with the support of Courtney and Suzanne and all the coaches, we're going to get the job done. Yeah, and tell me more about having Courtney as the head coach, um, what it's been like having her lead the team. Well, I know growing up, I was um, like, that was my that was my role model. She was amazing. I always wanted to be a George gym dog. And to have her expertise and her knowledge after having been a gymnast at Georgia, knowing exactly what to do, winning four national championships, um, it's inspiring to listen to what she has to say. And it's like walking book of like, knowledge when she talks so um, especially for me because I'm doing her new vault I think that we really take what she has to say and learn from it and make those adjustments and learn from the mistakes and I think that she's been an amazing coach mm -hmm. and you talk about um, what did you say confidence last year and then consistency this year um, what else has kind of been like a theme of this year for you guys our theme this year was whatever it takes but in the middle of the season we sort of had a turning point so it went from whatever it takes to we have what it takes so as of right now we are thinking we we have what it takes and um, to give it all we got. I think that's what we've been thinking. There's nothing to lose here. We got to go out. We have to be aggressive. We have to hit those handstands and give it all we got. And I think we'll reach the goals we are looking for. Yeah, I love that 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 theme kind of changed. Was that something coming in? You guys were thinking like it. This was like for the first part of the season, or was it like you guys knew how good you were? So I think it was after we beat Florida. I know we were ranked like ninth or something. Florida's ranked second and. Um, our theme at that point was still whatever it takes. Like we had posters that said whatever it takes and then after that meet, we had such a good meet, we won, we came back and we had shirts made that said we have what it takes versus whatever it takes. Because um, this team is so capable and so ready. So I think we do have what it takes and we're gonna have a great performance tomorrow.